um, this one is a ceramic capacitor which exploded this afternoon when I was tuning the HF SSTC. You can see that this one is made in Japan. 1000 picofarad, 7 kilovolts AC, and 12 kilovolt amperes. You can see here is a breakdown point here. And uh, you can see this one is burnt burnt and uh, here burnt also here and uh, this capacitor was mounted here was mounted here and uh, it's a high frequency bypass capacitor which paralleled with this around around 10 microfarad um, filter capacitors and when I was tuning this setup I turned the voltage to around uh, after the filter to around 6.4 kilovolts and at that point the capacitor exploded you can imagine that a 10 microfarad capacitor discharge at around 6.4 kilovolts. That's what happened here several minutes ago. It's very loud, almost like a gun firing a gun. And my ears um, was very uncomfortable at that moment but now they have recovered um, this oscillator I built this oscillator last night using a triode tube triode and uh, the tube has a plate dissipation at around 200 watts you can see its anode is quite small compared to um, compared to these tubes. You can see this tube and uh, that tube, and uh, this tube here. You can see the anode size. This one is the same uh, same type uh, is the same triode as I used on my oscillator. You can see the anode is quite small compared to this. This anode has an anode dissipation at around 350 watts. This anode also 350 watts. And this Siemens RS1026 also 350 watts. This is a triode. And uh, this is a triode. This is a tetrode. And uh, also a tetrode, also a tetrode. Um, now let's uh, run this setup. First of all, the filament. The filament and uh, the barriac. I need something to strike the arc. Okay.